This tutorial shows how easy it is to configure an IX runtime application, an X2 operator panel, or a Box2 device to act as an OPC UA server. This enables OPC UA clients such as SCADA systems, HMIs, and ERP systems to easily read and write tag data in the OPC UA server. Let's get started. We start by selecting the Box2 device in Warp. Right click and select IX Developer. An existing application that should be extended with an OPC UA server is now opened. When opening the tag editor, we notice that the application already contains four tags. Tag 1, Engine 1 RPM, Engine 1 Alarm Code, and Engine 1 Temperature. Click on the System tab, and then on the OPC UA Server icon. Check the Enable OPC UA Server checkbox. It's possible to select if anonymous logins should be allowed, but it's always recommended to use a username and password to maintain security. Finally, select Tag Visibility. Through customized options, it is possible to select which tags should be visible for the OPC UA clients. A new column is now visible in the tag grid, allowing the selection of tags that should be visible. The application is now configured and ready to be downloaded to the Box2 device. The transfer process is started by clicking the download button. Select the target that the application should be transferred to and click on download. This part of the video has been edited and runs quicker than normal. The application is now successfully downloaded and running in the Box2 device. OPC UA clients, such as our powerful Web Factory SCADA solution, are now able to connect to the Box2 device to visualize and control the selected tags.